Hey, I'm gonna tase you. I'm gonna tase you. Stop. Stop. I'm gonna tase you. Hallway hoopla, first at 10. A brawl with a student ends with that student being tased, and now her mother is outraged. Tonight, the child is facing charges as the school investigates what happened in this taser turmoil. Good evening, I'm Chris Carter. Officials are being tight-lipped about what happened. According to a parent of one of the students, the incident happened at Gosnell High School around noon yesterday. In this KIT exclusive, our Alejandro Hernandez walks us through the body camera video of what happened and talked to one teen's parent. Hey, I'm gonna tase you. I'm gonna tase you. Stop. Stop. I'm gonna tase you. Dramatic moments at the Gosnell High School. Stop. Hey, do I? Do you want me to tase you? Stop. <laughs> then, then, then. When police responded to a fight between two students, where one Monteria Hancock ended up being tased. Natasha King is Monteria's mother. When I seen the footage and I seen how the officer was the one actually doing all that nonsense and just being so excessive and forceful with her, it just it just took me to a whole different level. King said her daughter was charged with disorderly conduct and suspended for 10 days. Penalties that worry her. This was her first fight ever. And I have mm -hmm. records right there to show that she's never been in trouble since she's been in school. To make matters worse, King said no one was contacted about the fight or tasing. I was in class in Tennessee and I just so happened to check my phone and um, I got a text from my daughter saying, Mom, I was in a fight and I was tased, but I'm okay, stay at school. Throughout the video, the police officer asked about Hancock's mother, saying that he knows her. He asked her about her grandmother, Anna Jones, and told Hancock someone would contact them. Both mom and grandmother said that didn't happen. I didn't know anything, and I work at the junior high school in Gosnell, right across the field from the high school, and no one informed me about the fight. Jones was also concerned her granddaughter was not with a parent or guardian when she was with police. I was not there. You had her in the office talking to her, and she's a juvenile. I should have been present. I want you to be able to come to me at any time. But I can, when I get involved, it's a little different story, okay? Towards the end of the 30-minute body camera video provided by Hancock's grandmother, the same officer who tased her can be heard comforting her. You're not a bad kid. No, she's not. Okay. We can work with that. A student described by police as good and bright is left wondering about her future after trouble on Tuesday. Hey, I'm going to tase you. In Gosnell. Stop. I'm going to tase you. Alejandro Hernandez. Stop. Stop. Region 8 News. Now, we reached out to the Gosnell School District for comment. It, it said it is investigating the situation. The Gosnell Police Department would not comment on an ongoing investigation. You can watch the entire unedited body camera video right now on the Region 8 News app.